Five A. It's just gone high tide, and it's about about 20 to 7 in the morning. The sun should be coming up any minute now. We'll head up around the bottom end of Waiheke and see if we can find some snapper. There's a couple of other jet skis who are going to be up today, so we might meet up with them later on. But yeah, it's supposed to be a nice calm day for it. So we've got our lines in the water. Just sort of figuring out where we're drifting at the moment. And we've got a fish on. Very first drop. Doesn't feel very big. But if this is a fish. It's just a little snapper. He can go back. Pretty good start to the day. Okay, so I caught one fish on the double trouble, and then I was just using the soft bait, but um, the wind's got up a little bit, and it's making it too hard to get the lure down there and still be able to feel it. So I've just moved to a 100 gram better bug, and I'll drive back over the fish and see if I can drop that on them. What you doing there, little fella? You keep looking under the water, waiting for me to pull up a fish, don't you? So we're just having another change up. Had no takers on the better bug. So, move to a different colour and I'll try the Kibura. Kiburas seem to be really good when the bite's hard. So I'll give them a go. See if it'll work. I like to use slightly heavier leader for kaburas, at least 30 pound, because obviously the head is sliding. So if you use something a little bit heavier, it gives you a little bit more abrasion resistance on here. It makes your trace last a little bit longer. So we've just changed our spot again. Trying to get out of the weather a little bit and Somewhere it's a little bit more sheltered. So this is just another area of foul ground that I fish. And we'll see if there's any fish there. There is fish on the sounder. You can see here, there's a bit of sign there. And there's a few bigger marks on the fish reveal. And so just throwing the soft bait out, switch back to the soft bait now, since we're out of the current a bit. And get it down there and see what happens.
Well, I don't know what it is, but all my normal spots seem dead. There's a few turns working in there in the shallows. I might go and see if there's any snapper under them. Well, still no fish, and there's a shower starting to come through over there. Hopefully I don't get too wet. Doesn't really matter on a jet ski anyway, because you're wearing wet weather gear. Training. Well, I finally caught something. A baby snapper. Back you go, buddy. So I've just come in quite close to the rocks. Looking at the side scan and the looks like quite felt ground over that way, so may as well just stop and have a few casts. I've been meaning to get into the shallow water fishing a lot more than what I do. Because normally I'm always fishing in sort of 20 plus meters. So we've come in a bit shallower to hide out of the weather again and we're just going to try casting around these wash areas. What's that? Yeah. Oh, only one snapper. Yeah, fishing's been average, eh? It is, eh? Uh, you know, the weather changed. Yeah. I got caught in that storm out the first. Holy heck, did it come down, mate? I was <laughs> like, oh, I need to get some stuff to land for real bad. Oh, yeah. I was wondering if the matter was made for a bit. Was there anything out at the reef? Yeah. Yeah, it might be some kingies. Finally managed to hook a snapper. Well, hopefully a snapper. I don't think it's very big. But I think if it's legal we'll keep it. Because we're not going very good today. Huge. I think you can go back. So we're dropping the Kabura down again and we're just using the engine of the ski to keep us in the right place. Stop us drifting too fast. Finally, it's 
starting to get a little bit worried there. Thought we may not catch anything today, but I think we'll be all right from now. Once again, just drifting with the motor going and using the ski, flipping it out of neutral and then forwards to just keep us on the spot. Another nice snapper, biggest one of the day so far on the Kabura. And there we go, got another fish on. Let's so we'll turn the motor off now and we can wind them in. Smaller one that time. Maybe just try the soft bait. See if that'll get any bigger fish. So we're just doing the same thing with the soft bait that we were doing with the Kabura. Just takes a bit longer to sink down to the bottom because it's lighter. So I didn't have any luck on the soft bait, so I've just switched back to the Kabura and we're back into another fish. Doesn't feel like a big one, but one. So I was just going out to fish the 14 metre pin. I just saw a little depth change for only of about a meter or two. It had a little bit of sign on top, so I marked it. Tim turned around, dropped the Kavira down, and it hooked up before it even got to the bottom. That's the kind of fishing I like. It was pretty hard going in where it was before. I was catching the odd fish here and there and Denzel was getting a few around the birds. Um, he's gone back in now. The conditions are getting a bit better so I figured I may as well stay out. Well the snapper fishing has been really bloody slow. Um, so I've just put a kingfish jig on. Um, I'll give kingfish a go, see if I can catch one of them. I had a text from and a missed call from Robert this morning and he stopped in the Tamaki Strait on his way up from Maraitai and um, got his limit of snapper there in one drift. <laughs> so his day has been the complete opposite to mine. but. That's how it is sometimes, you should just stay and fish your feet first. That's where the saying comes from. Well, there's no kingfish, so I'm going to head back in closer to Waiheke, try for a few more snapper. So I thought I'd try another spot on my way home, just to see if I can pick up a few more panties. And this one's too small, but at least I'm catching fish, so I should be able to get a couple more. Well, I was heading home and this could be my saving grace. I found a bit of a workup going on. So with a bit of luck, there'll be some snapper underneath. 
could just be car wire though, but you don't know unless you try. We've got a snapper, it's only a little guy though. He goes. Well, that was a bit of a disappointment. I was hoping for a few good snapper under the birds, but it was only babies and kawai, so not what we're after. So I think it's time to head back to the ramp. Well, that's another day done and dusted. I don't know what it is out this side, but some days it's just such a struggle to find the fish anywhere. I don't know where they go. Probably still there, they just don't want to eat. But yeah, the swell is a bit high on the west coast. Otherwise, I would have been going back up there and catch some more kingies and sharks. But, um, yeah, it wasn't a bad day out. It's always good to be out on the water. Wind in the morning was a bit of a pain, made it quite hard to fish. But yeah, we've got some fish for dinner anyway, so that's the main thing. I think I'm gonna stop at the dairy, get an ice cream. And that's about it from me. Thanks for watching.